a rule of thumb is a third of it's going to be hardware and two-thirds of the price of the project is going to be installation. Once they start to see the value and how it comes together, the price is typically not the issue as long as they have it budgeted and within their system. If you think that it's expensive to put a $5,000 gas detection system in, if someone yeah. gets hurt or injured or God forbid they die, then trust me, that's going to be a lot more than it is to put in a working gas detection and set up SOPs to help ensure the safety of your employees. Typically, whatever the obstacle is, I usually can overcome that. If it's a money issue with a COO, I'm able to have those conversations. If it is, well, Clint, uh, we've never used wireless and we're concerned about that technology, well, let me explain to you how wireless was developed. And by the way, Mr. Customer, when wireless gas detection first came out, I was scared of it too. There's just been so many advances in technology. Let me explain where it started and where we currently are, and this is why you can trust the system. Once we have actually done a site assessment and come up with the best solution, then I can give a price to our distribution partner within five business days after we have done a complete assessment and decided what products you need installed. And then the second reference that they will be making is how long does it take you to get this installed for us and we're up and running. And we'll do adjustments according to our customer's needs. And so for an average system of say 12 points of gas detection, it will take us somewhere between four and six days on site to install that system. Totally depends on the length of runs of wires. If it's a wired system, it depends on how many pieces of product we're interfacing with. But the timeline, it's such that we can meet any requirement that they give us. Uh,